getting ready to go on my birthday. Let's see. Fishing on your wife's birthday? I done took care of her. <laughs> <laughs> She's got a brand new dance for her birthday. Uh huh. She got birthday cake and a uh, birthday card okay. today. So. Is that birthday or birthday? Well, it's spelled B-I-R-T-H-D-A-Y. Uh-huh. You know, I'm from the South. <laughs> and so... I am too. <laughs> sometimes I don't pronunciate those T's and all he that. He says birthday all the time. It's a habit. I don't think it's a habit. It's just the way I want to do it. It's just the way you roll. That's the way I roll. You want to get catch some crappie? Yes, absolutely. He's got the best wife that's letting him go off on his on her birthday. Patagonia. I want him to go and have a good time. And that way I'll get what I want while he's gone. <laughs> I'm gone. Well. well, that didn't sound too good, did it? I'm going to me I'm taking Mama Love to the doctor and then I'm going to Hobby Lobby afterwards. But I'm not I got everything. That's my fishing man right there. I'm the cutest birthday card that he got me since we just got back from Disney World. <clears throat> it says, if the seven dwarfs were created just for you, let me read it here. So they would be kissy, snuggly, lovey, dovey, laundry, jewelry, and shell. <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> Is that not the cutest thing? I'll take a uh, kissy, snuggly, lovey, dovey. I do my own laundry, but the jewelry and shelf, absolutely. <laughs> Good birthday card, babe. I love it. That's perfect after just getting back from Disney World. My husband picks out the best cards. He finds the best birthday cards. And I really don't care for him going off on my birthday because this man works hard. I work hard for the money. You sure do. Hard for our money. And I think Ashley's taking me out tomorrow night. And then I'll probably do something Saturday night with some friends. So but I'm going to miss She's you. She's going to party and have fun. I'm not going to party. Sure you are. You're going to party like it's 1999. <laughs> I did party in 1999. That was the year after I married you. <laughs> well, don't we'll argue that. Don't we'll argue that. Give me some bite what? Wait. what? No PDA. <laughs> no PDA. I love you. Love you. Just saw him off. He just pulled out right in front of me. And you're like, are you seriously letting your husband go off on your birthday? Absolutely. Hardest working man. And I have actually been pushing him. <clears throat> he and his brothers get, they go in and get so many weeks together on, um, in South Alabama at a campground and they put the um they put a camper down there and they leave it down there for several weeks and they split up the weeks that they go and i don't know if you've ever eaten crappie but it is the cleanest white fish to me that there is that can be caught out of the river uh it's not fishy it's not like cat catfish is real fishy but crappie is beautiful white fillet and we do a um i, I don't think i've I haven't done a video of our um, annual fish fry because uh, we've been doing it every year since John's daddy passed away and it's just gotten huge. We didn't do it this past year because uh, family, some of the family members were moving and it just it just didn't work out good. So, uh, but we'll have it. We'll have one in the spring, and I'll be able to show you some fish. So, yeah, tomorrow's my birthday, and um, I don't care. <laughs> he is just now getting to a place, I promise y'all this, after three years in this position, that he feels like he's leveling out a little bit to be able to go. I don't think he went fishing. They fish spring and fall, and I don't think he went at all last year. I think it was so hectic at work. I don't think he got to go. So when he started mentioning going, Ashley said, Mama, that's your birthday weekend. And so when he said something, he didn't even realize it. And, uh, and so when he said something about going, I said, that's my birthday. And he said, oh man. So 
so then he had thought about leaving Sunday, going Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. But when we've checked the weather, it's beautiful. It's already 64 degrees here today. I told him, I said, babe, please go on. I said, I don't know. Birthdays are special and I do like to do things, but uh, we go out to eat all the time. We go shopping together all the time. Um, he found that desk. We were at Home Goods the other night. And he knows we've been looking forever. And because um, I wanted a desk to go in my little den. I've, I've told y'all this so many times that I have a huge living room. I mean, huge area downstairs. And I just don't like to go to the basement. I just don't like to go down there. I like to stay up on the upper part of my house. And so this little desk is just really cute and um, fits in my den perfectly. And I got it sitting facing right out to the front of my house so I can just see everything. And uh, so he found it at Home Goods before I did a few weeks ago. And he said, Come here, I want to show you something. So we walked around. He said, I think this would fit in your den perfectly. And I said, Well, I do too. <laughs> I love it. And so we got it right there on the spot. And that's what you have to do at Home Goods. If you see something you like, you better get it right then. Um, going to pick up my mom love right now and um huh, i really don't feel like going anywhere today uh, upper respiratory bronchitis kind of stuff kind of i feel like the infection's kind of still in my body because and maybe i'm coming down off the trip a little bit too but i mean i've done amazingly well i really have haven't been able to rest very well the last few nights um been up real early and um just troubled sleep dreaming all kind of stupid dreams so just got a phone call from um, on one of my former employees uh, she's just one of my dearest friends um, she's a beautiful black lady full of the Lord and full of the Holy Ghost and they were asking she got a new job and she told me she was going to use a reference and I told her I said look I'm retired right now but if I was still working, I'd hire that woman every day. <laughs> She's beautiful. She, uh, if you've ever seen an example of a black and a white person being so close and, and sharing the love of God, we are a perfect example of that. And, you know, sometimes in your jobs, when you have to make tough decisions, you can get things said about you, uh, whether, you know, you be racist, call you racist if they don't like your decisions. That woman right there will tell you that I love her with my whole heart. And uh, we're, we're tight. We're uh, ebony and ivory. <laughs> I'm going to pick up my mom. Hey, mama love. Hello. Isn't she pretty in her red? <laughs> Lady, when you get my age, you have to wear red to get attention. Lord help, you don't need any more attention. You <laughs> call it out, <laughs> call it out. Yeah, we gotta go to the bank. We I gotta got to go, go get money. Money, 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 money. Takes more to take care of me now than it ever did in my whole life. Lord, she don't spend nothing hardly. <laughs> don't hardly spend nothing. She does so good, <laughs> so content. That's such a blessing. Well, I could be raising the devil, you know. Well, now you're getting a little old to be raising the devil. Well, no, just, no, that, that's not the ooh, truth. There's a lot of old people that do raise seen the some devil. Of the old folks that when I was working, mother used to be a visiting nurse. She would go in. She worked for the visiting nurse association, and you went in and took care of them, didn't you, Mama? Bathed, bathed, bathed them, them. done everything for them, and was enjoyed every bit of it. How many years did you do that? Probably two or three years. Yeah. And she wasn't actually a nurse. She no, was. Uh, you were a CNA, though, weren't you? That's right. Just Certified just, nursing I went assistant. Went home and took care of. Me. Yeah. I went and cleaned up some awful messes. <laughs> it was. It was the best thing that ever happened to her after my daddy died. You started it before. Yeah. You did it longer than three years, didn't you? It's probably longer than that. Yeah. I, 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 time don't mean anything to me. Yeah. You probably did it five or six years. I don't know how long it was, but it's the best thing that ever happened to me because it got me out of that house. I'm still drinking on our drink from yesterday. I put it in the refrigerator. <laughs> Uh, I just was just saying, I just feel like that infection's in my body. I just, and those antibiotics have been making me sick at my stomach. So it's kind of like, I need the antibiotics, but they make me sick at my stomach, but I don't feel like that infection's out. Well, I'm just going to have to do something. But maybe by the time we get out and rock and roll and <laughs> hoochie coo today, we'll feel better. <laughs> I'm glad it's my ears and not something else. I'm glad it's not your hoochie coo. <laughs> Good God. 
I've been poked at, punched at everything all my life. And I am Mama's in. got a stopped up ear. I'm convinced it's stopped up because she cannot Even hear. With her contraptions on Even with her hearing aids, I'm having to repeat everything twice. Somebody's building a little house right I think, there. I really think that it's possible it could be a habit a lot of that. I do too. I really do. I got some new lipstick in my Ipsy bag. It's a butter, something butter. It's kind of pretty. Kind? New lipstick. Mother, Lord help us, Jesus. Have I got the shirt on wrong side out? No, no, it's Susanna's, just got. Suzanne, here's where you got born. Though. I know. I got brought home. Got brought home. <laughs> the little house is gone, but I was. It burned. Uh -huh. Is there another house in this place? Yeah, that little tan one right there. Right there. Okay. That one right there. Uh -huh. so where it's at. It's where they brought me home to. That's when I had, was so proud when the tornado came that they said it was going to be in the Okay, County. this land right here, we're in what's called Jefferson County. And it's it just right. as soon as we go on this other road, yeah. it's going to be Walker County. Yeah. And she said, she was like 29 when she had me. <laughs> and she said when she lived there, they said something about the tornado being in Walker County, and she lived right on the other side of the line of Jefferson County, so she was glad it wasn't in Jefferson County, <laughs> like it couldn't cross the county line. I got three feet. <laughs> I mean, we're fixing to be in Walker County right now with me turning. So. <laughs> God, you were like... I was a little on the dumb side. <laughs> <laughs> well, sure, I'm glad I'm in another county. <laughs> I bet you are. Well, the toilet down there set within a foot of the line. The outside toilet. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, Israel, wasn't it? We had to do it. That's where we had the rooster in the airport. I'm poor little Randy to go to the toilet with that rooster and run her back home. <laughs> Can you imagine having to go to an outside toilet and then the rooster running you back home? I mean, that was not fun at all. <laughs> well, she'd come in there like a wild Indian and I'd go to throw something at him and make it. That was the meanest rooster I believe I ever seen. What were y'all doing with him? Did you have chickens or was it just a rooster? Oh, your daddy had him. Oh, Lord. We had him for, but I know one he liked to beat us every one of them. Well, I'll be a cow's hind leg. I'll be a cow's hind leg. That's the stupidest thing you ever heard. I got some birthday cards. Ooh, what did the fox say? Ding, 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 ding. And a box. Uh -oh. But I'm gonna open them up when I get home today oh, or tomorrow. In no. Oh, why? Cause. I'm not want that. No, that's I pretty. I don't what I need with it. Whatever it is. It's. I, I don't think I can open don't it. Don't open it till you get it for you. But this oh. lady. Oh, I know her name. She's been. She's been writing on my wall. She's from Miami. How precious. Can't wait to open it and see what it is. <laughs> but I'm gonna wait till I get home and yeah, open my yeah, cards yeah, together. Yeah. And I'll probably get some more tomorrow. Oh, that's gonna fall off. I'll just fix it. No, I'm gonna sit it back there. Uh, we kept that grinning boy yesterday. <laughs> he had mother going. He's <laughs> he just really a grinning. Over, buddy. I'm telling he you. was just a grinning. He was laughing and playing with my fingers. And of course, you know, he does great with us because we just sit and hold him and laugh at laugh with him and and poor old Ashley when she tries to get something done, <laughs> he's, he's squalling. Well, we all know that. We yeah. all know that if we had babies. Yeah. So, but he is a precious little fella. He is. Ain't he no doubt about it. So cunning. He, that mouth spreads wide open, <laughs> laughing. And he's beginning to make rackets. Too. Oh yeah, he was gooing yesterday, yeah. and he's wanting to talk some. What you doing? <laughs> what you doing? I don't. Blow, I don't wave at people. She blows like. <laughs> Howdy, Mark, his uncle. What are you doing? Dad? How you doing? How you doing? All right. Are you filming this <laughs> yes. thing? Are you? I'm going to be on you, YouTube. Ain't he pretty? Oh, Look how I'm a pretty. Dog. I'll leave the hat on. <laughs> well, I'm going to turn I'm going to turn this off for a little while because we're going to be <laughs> rambling today. But we're going to get this woman's ear cleaned out. And if she can't hear them, they're going to hear Now look, if you don't start hearing after we get this done, you're going to put me in a home. I'm going to put you in a home far, far away. <laughs> I'm tired of repeating Never, everything. No telephone. No telephone. <laughs> I'm tired of repeating everything three times. It's just four times sometimes. Oh, Lord Jesus. Yesterday she'd be like, huh? Huh? Uh, I hate myself. Huh? So we're going to get her ear cleaned out. We I, might be back. We might not. I bet you I'll still say it out of habit. I bet you will too. I'm going to start slapping her. <laughs> You've heard of abusing the elderly? Yeah. 
And she's she ain't above slapping back though. She's still pretty feisty. So, but we're going to the ear doctor. We might talk to y'all a little bit later. But if not, we might have a better subject. We might have a better subject. We've been kind of boring this morning. So. <laughs> Neither one of us are quite up to par. So, all right. But we might talk to you later. Bye. Tell her how oh, pretty so she looks, Dr. Dana. Oh, that's beautiful. She's that old uh, Coumadin is oh, breaking her that, face that out. Listen, mean, listen. Unstop the ears. Ooh. Unstop those ears, please. Is it full of mess? Uh, yes, ma'am. Yeah. And your hearing aid. Yeah. She is, she is not hearing. I say, huh, to her, and I've got it, and she gets some mad at me. I don't talk about rats. <laughs> we got a good rat story to tell you. What's this rat sleeping? It's attached to you. I'm sorry, I'm she can say, I can hear, I can hear, <laughs> and I can chew. And we've been eating it out, Louise. <laughs> she treated us today. <laughs> My plate's clean. <laughs> so now where are we going after we eat? <laughs> We're going to ho Lobby Hobby, as you call it. We're going to Lobby Hobby, and then I'm taking her butt home. Miss Natter. Tomorrow's my birthday. You gonna bake me a cake? I you can't bake... make a cake. It like, looks like yes, a cake. you bake Matthew a cake. Yeah, but it didn't look good. He But um, yeah, I just ate some Mexican chicken, and she's eating some chicken things. She said she was gonna take it home with her, but she keeps eating them it over there. So, but then we're going to Lobby Hobby, as she calls it, and then we're going home. I'm putting her butt out at the of the curb. And um, I'm going home. I'm putting my pajamas on. So, but anyway, it's been a fun day. We'll talk to y'all later. Come back. Bye. Bye. <laughs>